This is how you replace a screen for a Toshiba C650. This is a laptop that has a 15.6 LED screen. And here if you take a closer look right here, uh, on the edge of the laptop there are four screws. There's one on the top, one on the, on the bottom there. And then there's one there and one on the other side. So that's a total of four screws right there. There's one here another one here, there's another one here, and here. So you'll need only two tools here to get this done. You'll need a, a, a screwdriver with a Phillips head. Uh, uh, that's a four edges plus or Phillips head. And then there's a flat. That's the minus. So carefully first remove the, all the four screws, which I've already done. And after you have removed the screws, just, just peel the front uh, off of the laptop. And that's, that's just like this. So, yeah. You can see here I've peeled the side of the, the screen out of the laptop right there. And now what I'm going to be doing is taking that off carefully. Now you need to use a Phillips head uh, or a flat bit screwdriver. Now you're going to have to flip the laptop and then there are two notches on the back. There's one here, the one on the other side. And you're going to have to remove both of them. So, using a flat pin screwdriver, just do that. That's one out. There's the next one. Next one out. And the other one out. Have the front panel out here and just keep the front panel aside. And this is the part where the screen is connected. So now we'll remove the screen. That we'll be using the we'll be using the plus screwdriver to do that. The screen has, uh, if you take a closer look, there are screws on the side here. And there's one right here. And there's any other one right here. And there's the other one right here. So I'll remove three from each side. Three this side. And three this side. Pin the three screws out of this side and the three screws out of this side. The screen is going to be easily falling down like that. Now be careful, some laptops they have a connection of a webcam that should be right here and it should be connected directly on the back of the screen. There should be a glue. So if there is a glue on the back of the screen, just be careful not to let it fall down. First, safely plug out the webcam connection from here, and then fall. this particular laptop has a webcam connection. That's a good, good design, by the way. That is attached from the side, going directly into the laptop. So that's a, that's a good design there. So once the screen falls out, here is the connection for the screen. So you just have to carefully remove the connection using a flat pin screwdriver. Just be very careful while you're doing this. Yeah. Okay. And then there's this whole glue that's connected here. And there. 
so now you have this cream all outside, just put it aside grab a new screen and then put it back in so same way I'm gonna grab a new screen for this laptop and then put this connection back in very carefully Okay, so that's a good bond. Now we just want to make sure the new screen is working. So we'll flip the screen and then press the power switch. There, the screen is working pretty good. So just turn it off and then we'll change the screen, put it back together the way we started. So first the six screws on this side and then three on this side, sorry, and then three on the other side and then put the frame back on it put the frame ready to go and then we'll put it together so let's get started put on the frame of the laptop just be careful while putting on these notches here these are pretty much, you can break them easily very fragile right there so after you put it on you have to attach it by just clipping it. That's how it will clip all the four sides. When it's clipped on, it's time to carefully attach the screws on all the four sides. So now the screen replacement is done, the new screen is installed, we'll turn it on and make sure when you turn on the laptop you verify your webcam is working, you verify your wireless internet is working and you verify your uh, microphone is working because these connections are attached to the, to the computer on the screen, on the screen.